Hello everyone, my name is Hector Mendoza. I'm going to be posting some videos on civility in the next few weeks. Uh, I've got most of my videos for Xactimate. If you ever have questions about my videos, you can email me at Hector Mendoza Justin at yahoo.com. Here's a, a bunch of the videos that I already have posted. Uh, this part right here, it's a eight part series on how to become an adjuster from actually learning how to apply for uh, the adjuster license all the way to making a claim. Then it's broken down into uh, more detailed. Th these are just broad uh, areas of, of those subjects. So you can um, look at all these videos that I actually have. So you can pause this video and see if you might like one of them. But what we're going to do today is create a claim or take ownership of a claim in civility. So uh, by now, you should have already have your uh, civility installing your uh, computer and so this is what it looks like when you log in and then you, when you log in uh, your home page is going to look like this <clears throat> the first thing you want to do is is synchronize every time you uh, start okay because otherwise it, it might take a while to synchronize if you got a bunch of things to do at once okay so a <clears throat> couple of things. Uh, let me go over this uh, menus down here. You have uh, this folder that has uh, that tells you to create claim. So if you create a claim, it's going to cost you fifteen dollars for that claim. Now a lot of your uh, carriers pay for this. Some of them don't, but let's say you have to pay for for your claims. <clears throat> um, when you create a claim, they're going to charge you fifteen dollars, all the way up to ten claims. Once you make ten claims, that's the maximum you're going to pay for that month. Now. So if you multiply 150 times 12, it's $1,800 a year. But the good thing about Simbility is that, you know, if you're not, let's say you don't work for two or three months, you're not being charged. And so the price is basically the same that you would pay for Xactimate, except that with Xactimate, you can't be practicing on it. Uh, once you pay for it, you can practice uh, while the uh, when you're not paying for it. So with Simbility, let's say one month you only work three claims, uh, you know, so it's forty-five dollars. That's it, and then you can practice and practice. So if you create a new claim with this uh, folder, it's going to cost you uh, fifteen dollars. This create temporary, you can click on this one and create a temporary claim. You're not going to get charged nothing for it. You just can't upload images. Or you can't upload it to, you know, Simbility. Okay. So, uh, so this is recent claims this is just a pull down of uh, of the recent claims that uh that are there you can select the ones that you want right so you see how this stuff is grayed out except synchronize we just synchronized just a while ago so you see if i click here all of a sudden acquire our ownership comes available okay also download claim if, you, if if this claim was uploaded you you could download it uh, so you see that little hand 
if you have that little hand except on a uh you know uh, a grain folder you don't have ownership that means you can see it so what i did was i i, I put one and, and this one is not uh it doesn't it's not acquired in other words i don't have ownership of this claim so basically, if somebody don't have ownership of claim, they can see everything. They can see the folders. They can see everything, except they can't work on it. And let me show you. So I'm going to double click on the claim. You see how everything's grayed out here? I can't edit nothing. Okay. So if I go to my floor plan, and there's a lot of people that can take ownership of a claim. I, I, uh, they can look at a claim and not have ownership. So let me see. You see right here? I can see I, I can see the measurements, but I can't change nothing. See if I try to click on this, it it, it doesn't allow me to make any changes. Okay, so okay, so right now it's uh preloading price data because I double clicked on this and Sometimes this takes a little bit of time. We're going to go over this later. I'm, I'm, we're going to ignore it for right now. Okay, so I'm going to collapse it. Same thing. I can look at the floor plan. I can look at the images. Uh, uh, you know, but I cannot do nothing to it. I can select it, but it don't do nothing. Okay, so that's what taking. Now I'm going to close this. So when you're going to close something, if you close with that little red uh, square, you're going to close the whole document. Now, if you want to close this document, you know, all you got to do is hit the little close button. Otherwise, you're going to close the whole document, uh, the whole program. If you hit that X anytime on the upper right hand corner, that X that's red, that means you're going to close the whole thing. So now I have another one here that has ownership on it okay that one i have ownership so i can make changes to it so let's go to the floor plan this time <clears throat> see if i click here boom now i can make changes so okay so let me go back uh, so I want to explain all this stuff before uh, before we continue, because I need for you to understand this stuff before we play around with some of the stuff. Okay. So another, um, if you see a folder, and that folder has a little red mark on it. That means that it's uploaded and somebody else has ownership and you, you're not able to do anything with it. It'll look like that. You see that little circle right here? Is that you cannot participate on it. Okay, so so much for the uh, taking ownership. What else was I going to talk about? Let me see here. Uh, uh, creating a claim uh, and taking ownership. So. You, okay, so so I'm going to take ownership of this claim. Okay, so right now it doesn't have that little hand, right? Right there, like this one here. So I'm going to click here, and then I'm going to acquire ownership. Okay, so if I acquire ownership, I have to – now you see how this thing turned um, red? So if you click on it, it's let me acquire the ownership. Now at this point, as soon as it turns into that with that little hand, nobody can work on it. Everybody can view it. You can have a lot of participants. Everybody can see it at one time, but only one person can have ownership, and that's the only person that's going to be able to work on it. So this is the end of this claim, uh, uh, video. I'm about to show y'all step by step on how to work on civility. I do have a video out there 
that if you want to see, uh, that's pretty cool. And this almost shows you uh, a lot of the stuff. So actually, there's two videos. If you go in and type that in in um, in your um, you know YouTube, you'll see. And this is oh excuse me, this is Symbility. This is a Symbility one here, and then there's another one. Uh, Exactamate, 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 right here, Symbility. Those will show you how to draw a whole roof and a whole house. So check those out. But in the meantime, you're going to start seeing a bunch of um, videos. So if you want to keep track of what I'm doing, you can subscribe to me. And every time I create a new video, uh, video it'll let you know thank you for watching and here's my email address if you ever want to email me want to learn how to do something in exactimate or simplicity don't hesitate to email me uh, you can even ask me for my telephone number 99.9 percent .9 of the time i'm going to give it to you thank you